Hi guys, today you will know how to make smooth 3D text in After Effects. You have been asking me for this tutorial for a long time and I would really appreciate if you put like on this video and subscribe to my channel. I also want to remind you that there are only 1200 likes you need to get on tutorial how to make edits and the second part will release. Uh, there I will show you some difficult things, so I'll wait for your support. Now I won't distract you anymore, let's go to After Effects. I forgot to tell you that my pay hip soon will be close, because I found another website and on this website you can pay using PayPal. So if you have any troubles with my pay hip or there were problems after the purchase, write me in my Discord. Okay, now you press new composition and you can repeat my resolution or put uh, whatever you want. Uh, but don't forget to put frame rate to 60 fps. This is really important. Press OK. And now click here and new text and write your text. Here you can change the font. And the size. You can also align it to the center. After you chose the size and the font, uh, you can enable motion blur. And again, click here, right mouse button, new, and solid. Create black solid. Press OK. Go to effects and find element. Add to your black solid. And now you can turn off the text. Now you should open custom layers, custom text and masks, uh, path layer 1 and choose this here your text. Then press scene stop and click extrude. And your text will appear. Then you can turn off this option and your text will be more detailed and also change this uh, value here put my value then also uh, be well copies put two go here and choose be well two and change this setting and this also, you can uh, put the tick here and the well backslide will be appear. And you can also play with the settings and put it as you like. Now go to presets and choose Pro Shaders 2. Go to... You can uh, choose whatever you want, but I use metal, this metal, for be well one and this metal for be well two then go to environment click here and also change uh, also choose whatever you want for me it can be this and press ok after these steps you need to go to render settings lightning and choose here what you like. Uh, I usually use cinema or uh, 360. Then go to shadows and enable it. And after that go to this option, enable it also and change to ray traced. We do this because these options increase quality of text. For example, if we go here and increase the size of our text and put preview to full and if we come back all these settings, you will see the difference. Okay, so it is without these settings and it is with these settings. 
text become more detailed. Now you need to create the camera and light. Uh, press here, new, and create camera with 28 millimeters and create light with my settings. You can repeat it and duplicate it. Control D and turn off. And now you need to work with your first light. Put it like you want, but I usually put it like this. And now turn on your second light and put it like this or as you like it doesn't matter like this now you need to animate your text to do this select your black solid go to group one particle look multi object and put the tick here and this option is for rotation of your text, but you can play with it and watch what these values do. So I want to flip this text, so I put this value and click on clock. Press U on your keyboard, go a few frames ahead and put it minus 11. Okay, watch what you have. This is too slow, so select your keys, press F9, go to graph settings and choose edit value graph and just repeat my graph. And it, look, it looks nice. Also I like this option, it is like uh, increase your text size, like scale, I usually put one uh, 0.3 and uh, also select the keys, press F9, go to graph and use this graph. And your text will increase a little, like this. Also, I forgot to make a scale effect. For this, go to World Transform and click on clock here, press U and drag this point when your flip ends and at the beginning put 0 also select the keys, press F9, go to graph and also repeat the graph you did before and that's it it looks very smooth and nice also, I like to make this animation without flipping, just opacity. To do it, uh, just press, select your black solid, press T, and click on clock, put 0 for opacity, go a few frames ahead and put 100. And you will have something like this. You can also add uh, this option. Uh, click on clock, go a few frames ahead and put 0.3 select the keys, press F9, go to graph and repeat my graph and you will have something like this it also looks very smooth and nice. after that you can decorate your text to do this select or your uh, your text, your camera and light uh, holding control you can select it and pre-compose it. Right mouse button, pre-compose, repeat my settings, press OK. Then you can turn on motion blur and duplicate it using combination control D. Then go to effects and find deep glow and add to your second layer. And you can play with it. Here 300 for example, 1.5, here 100, Move blending and here you can put 25% for example. You will have something like this. 
I hope this tutorial was helped for you and your text has become more beautiful and smooth. And if this is so, don't forget to put like on this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your attention. See you soon, guys.